Yeah. Right, Josh. Um, these are five vocal singing techniques that we've um, put together. And um, it, once you, well, when you, you use these, and they're all five things that should work on different areas of the voice. So first of all, we have mana lava technique, which is um, a word we say up and down the scale. So um, we can, the word mana lava is actually designed to work on your consonants and for a certain vowel sound, the ah. So you work on that as you're going up and down the scale to make sure, because some, sometimes it's going through a scale. I find it in particular like harder to say to sing unu. Mm -hmm. Like I find that harder to mm -hmm. sing than ah uh, or something like that. Mm -hmm. So it's good for different words to work on different vowel sounds. Um, so I would like to start by reading the mother on the scale. Singing through your teeth almost, 
then you're going to be reaching notes. Um, you're going to be projecting your notes louder, you're going to be supporting it more naturally because of your face shape. Um, something I used to do a lot, and then I got taught not to do, well, I got, someone told me that, I was, that was affecting my singing. But so I was going for high notes, I was doing this thing where I was kind of like smiling, yeah. and like almost grimacing, and trying and tensing up because I was trying to get the high notes. And then the, um, one of my old teachers said to me that that's probably one of the worst things I could do. I should probably just, even if it's hard and high, don't tense up and make sure you just get as much air as possible and just stay relaxed mm -hmm. in the face um, and everywhere really, because tensing up is just, it's just wrong. It's not going <laughs> to get you anywhere. So do that. Um, and then, yeah, um, it will help you stop flattening notes and helps to keep you in tune. Um, and it can also help you resonate notes. And yeah, um, it's also good for your range as well. Because if you're tensing up, as I said earlier, if not, you're just not going to reach notes as well. So those, those are five tips that will help you with your Great, thank you, Joe.